The siege of Jaine was one of many sieges on the city during the Spanish Reconquista. The siege, was carried out from June 24 through September, 1230 by forces of the Kingdom of Castile commanded by Ferdinand III of Castile against the defending Tefa of Jaén. The battle resulted in a Jaénese victory after the Castilian withdrawal and abandonment of the siege immediately following the death of King Alfonso IX of Leon. In 1229, Ferdinand III of Castile resumed his military campaigns against his Moorish neighbors that had been ongoing since 1224. In 1225, a previous attempt to capture the city resulted in failure when the combined forces of the Kingdom of Castile and the Tefa of Biza withdrew due to a lack of proper siege equipment before the city's formidable defenses. In 1229, Ferdinand III commenced hostilities in the area around Jane, taking the castle at Odenar, which was a point of immense strategic significance if a siege of the city was to be undertaken, and pillaging the area surrounding the city. Throughout 1229, Ferdinand III continued actions on the area surrounding Jane for his eventual siege, capturing strong points and preparing for his siege the following year. The Siege On June 24, Ferdinand III of Castile who was by this time the King of Castile, commenced the formal siege on the city of Jane with a determination to capture the city that had withstood his previous siege attempt five years previously. The siege of 1230 presented a greater challenge than the one in 1225 due to the fact that the city defences had been significantly improved by the ruling Tefa of Jane as they had expected further Castilian aggression. As a result, Ferdinand III required a much larger army to mount a definitive and decisive blow to the city. According to the Chronicle of Avila, the Knights of Avila, who formed a portion of the Castilian assault force, were positioned on the Cerro del Neveral, and Neveral Hill, which was located directly in front of the castle walls. Their placement in this location was an apparent punishment for having arrived late to the city's previous siege five years before indicating the an unforgiving temperament on the part of Ferdinand III. From this position, the Knights of Avila were harassed by the city's trebuchet defenses. Mandolos Pasar el Rey en una cabeza que es sobre el Alcacar, e aerologar que non es e padrín a correr cuando menesterle fuis los de la Hust. Cronica de Avila by September, after a siege of around four months, Ferdinand III was obliged to withdraw prematurely a second time from his siege of the city, this time due to the death of his father, Alfonso IX of Leon. He ordered the siege lifted and travelled to Orgas to join his mother, Berengaria of Castile. The two then proceeded together to Leon where Ferdinand III, already King of Castile was to be crowned also as the King of Leon and of Galatia. Consequences. The city of Jane remained an independent Tefa for some time after the battle, eventually being incorporated into the Emirate of Granada. Jane would finally be permanently taken by Castilian forces in 1246 when the forces of Castile and members of the Order of Santiago under Ferdinand III of Castile and Peo Paris Correa, Grand Master of the Order of Santiago, returned to finish the capture of the defiant city, defeating a Granadan army under Mohammed I.I.B.N.N.A.S.R.